there are reasons why you shouldn't torture your Pokemon. If you do, these two will make sure it'll never happen again. It all started with the Mother Zorak protecting her little Zora was. She sprang out of their small den when a trainer reached into their home. The fight was fatal. The Mother Zorak was poisoned many times, causing her to fall back onto a rock. The rock impaled her, blood everywhere. The Zoras were squealing as they watched their mother die. The trainer looked viciously at the Zorawas, snatching them out of the den. They were separated by two rival Pokemon trainers. Both desperately wanted to be better than the other. The trainers immediately flung them into battle. Each time they only won six out of twenty battles. Each forty times the Zoras lost. They were tortured. Finally, they evolved. The trainer's pride didn't last long, as the two new Zoroarks sliced their bodies in half their long claws. The Zoroarks, now Bill and Zeta, flung through the window to meet up again. Now both Bill and Zeta have the needs to kill every trainer they see. Watch out for any Zoroarks you see. You'll notice them when they slice a mask ball and rip off your arms and legs.